Hello everyone and welcome back to our Tableau desktop training videos provided by Tableau Coach. This is the last video of our series that, um, that I'm doing to review the sample questions that are provided by Tableau that, um, that they send out to help you prepare for your exam. So this video will cover the last two questions, number 13 and 14. So let's go on and start with number 13. So what was the moving average of sales in June of 2012, including six months prior and six months after? All right. So what we need to do here is we need to create a view with sales by continuous month and use a table calculation to present a moving average. Now let's go step by step. We basically need um, month of order dates. So we're gonna, instead of year, we need the month and we need continuous. And another thing we need is a sum of sales, which is also continuous. Now, when you right click or drop down on, on sum of sales, we need to choose the add table calculation. We need to select the moving calculation under calculation type and select average for summarized values using. For moving along table, it's across. Previous values, we need to change that number to six and next values, we need to change that number to six. We're gonna go ahead and keep the check mark yes on include current values and say apply. Now, the date that we need to find is June 2012. So we can see May is here, April, May, Ju July, sorry, June of 2012. So the number here, the moving average of sales from the previous six to the next six, a long table across gives us 188,552, which gives us answer C. Moving on to our last question, number 14, we need to create a histogram showing the number of sales using sales bins of 1,000. Now, the question is we need to answer which bins have profit ratios of more than 25%. So what you need to do here is we need to right click on sales and we need to create, we need to create bins. So the new field name will be called sales bins and we need to change the bin size to be 1000. And then we just say, okay. Now, the next thing we need to do is we need to put sales over there and we can actually find our, um, our sales bin in here and as you can see a zero to a thousand a thousand to two thousand so here are our sales bins and um we need to change the sales on the row shelf to account function instead of sum of sales so we go to measure and count distinct okay now we need to create a profit margin calculated field so let's go ahead and um create a calculated field call it profit margin and basically the way we calculate that is sum of profit and we're going to go ahead and divide that by sum of sales so that's our profit margin and what did i do wrong too many parentheses okay we're going to hit apply we're going to hit okay and we're going to put the profit margin onto the label shelf. And we can also format the profit margin to be, um, to make it a percentage. So let's go ahead and do that. Find the profit margin, make that into a percentage. There we go. Now what we need to do is filter the view to only show bins with profit margin of greater than 25%. So we take our profit margin calculated field and we drag it onto filter and we change this to 0 0.25 that gives us 25 percent and we hit apply you can you can now see that the answer to our question um, of which bins have profit ratios above 25 percent is 7,000 8,000 11,000 and 18,000 and that brings us to the end of this video. So thank you so everyone for watching and please subscribe to our channel for more Tableau training videos. I hope you find this useful and if you still have any questions, feel free to comment below.
Thank you.